Greetings YouTube, uh, I apologize for starters to a couple of people who asked me to do this video like two days ago and I said I would and then I got busy and here we are. <laughs> so this was supposed to come out like two days ago, but hey, better late than never, right? Um, I have received a ton of feedback. When I say a ton, I mean like, I don't know, between 10 and 20 different people who didn't know they were messaging me with the same feedback, which to me is a ton given the amount of messages I get per day. And uh, it revolves around the new Cavalier difficulty nodes and specifically some of the complaints I've received that the summoners had ranked up champions specifically designed to tackle the old nodes that are basically worthless with the new ones and that they only use those champions outside of, I guess, if you run the arena for the Cavalier difficulty. And so... This is a combination of complaints about Kabam saying that it was going to be easier, but if you don't have the right champions, it's actually much harder. Uh, complaints that because it's much harder, it's actually numbing, like mind-numbing, to, uh, to do the special Cavalier emotional badge, uh, baggage uh, rank rewards quest with four stars. And like, this is not coming from people who have like even ever complained to my channel. It's not like you're thinking to yourself, oh, these people, they just, uh, they're just whiners. They're naggers. They're always going to complain about something. Some of these people have never complained to me at all, but they're used to doing the four star challenge in like, I don't know, five, six hours. And now it takes them five to six hours to do half of it, depending on the roster. And of course, like looking at the actual rewards, you, you don't get much really i don't think you get much i don't think this is worth it period i've done it once and afterwards i thought that eh, wasn't worth it the five star generic six stone you can get every day from a different daily quest just by completing the final milestone and i know that might be a little tough with something like event quest where you have to do multiple paths of like harder difficulty but in general arena wins hero use level up you know you name it uh you get one of those now depending on what progression level you are, I should say, just from doing your daily routine. So that's not a big draw at all. They just get one of those. And so of course you have to do everything to eventually get to six out of six and get the prized possession, which is the 10% tier five class catalyst fragment crystal. So I get sort of like a BAM thought it was easier because they, they think that there are certain champions that are going to be more useful than they've ever been before. But consequently, there are also champions that were useful before that aren't anymore. And I am now debating. I mean, I guess they're getting their goal from me because if I'm going to tackle more of this Cavalier because I've only done a few paths so far, I'm going to have to take up new champions. I actually might take up Hulkbuster to rank two as a six star. And I've never considered that. But then I also think, well, if I end up not using him again, because I've never used him in real content, even after the buff, uh, is it going to be a waste of a rank up? I don't know. And then if I'm kind of on the fence about a waste of a rank up, maybe I'm just not going to do th th much Cavalier at all. And I'll just miss out on those rewards. But to me, it won't be that big of a deal. But at the same time, Kabam is doing these changes in theory to inspire more people like myself to clear more content. So it seems like it's almost counterproductive or counterintuitive to what they're trying to achieve. So the bottom line is this. I've heard three different complaints. One specifically that champions that were ranked up before for the past nodes are now worthless depending on who you're talking about and they wish they got those rank ups back specifically rank down tickets that we know i just want to point this out in this video we know kabam is not going to give rank down tickets it's like an impossibility they have stated over and over again that they hate giving out rank down tickets it might be the biggest regret they made but they, they were forced to after patch 12.0 because of how shady that historic president was for nerfing champions that had always been really good and really op like scarlet witch uh but because of that um you're left with champions you're just not going to use and it's annoying and i get that and then i also get that there's this trust factor where it's like, okay, I just ranked up those champions to handle Cavalier difficulty. I don't use them anymore, so I could do that again, but the nodes are probably going to change again, and then these champions are going to be just as worthless as the ones that are now worthless, so I have trust issues because maybe I shouldn't rank them up like I talked about with Hulkbuster, although I guess he'd be valuable at some point, maybe outside of that no matter what because of his tier. Uh, and then the third thing is, all of this means that it's harder to uh, clear in the same amount of time the Cavalier difficulty with the team of four stars and that is also 
making it not worth it to chase after this 10% tier 5 class catalyst fragment crystal. If they had... Oh, I guess here's complaint number four, is that had they buffed the rewards with the new nodes, then more people would understand it because they kept the rewards the same, and this is not a selector even, it's a crystal. There is this frustration that we have seen time and time again with different aspects of this game, that it's more work for less reward, and uh, that obviously contributes to burnout in general. So... If you love these new nodes, if you think all these complaints are not valid or reasonable, I want to hear from you because I want to hear both sides of this. I've only heard one side of it, and I always like to get all opinions. So please, in the comments, say what you really think about this new Cavalier difficulty and the new nodes and maybe some of the champions that you might have to take up. I get that Kabam wants you to have to use different champions, but it, it's tough because obviously if rank down tickets did exist, you'd be able to rank down the champion you no longer use and put the resources into this period's new champions. And yeah, I do think the rewards definitely should be buffed. I think they should have been buffed from the beginning, but uh, especially now that we have a new, it almost feels like a new season of Cavalier difficulty, even though Kabam wouldn't look at it that way. All right, YouTube, thanks for watching. Have a good one. And please let me know what you think of the controversy in the comments below.